Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jessica, and as you can see by the title of today's video, I wanted to share some of my favorite low-carb snacks. These are more healthy alternatives for snacks. I am a huge snacker, and when I am sitting at my desk, I just grab basically everything in sight and eat it. So, I wanted to share with y'all some options that I've found that I think are really, really amazing. So first, starting off with this little guy. This is called Pro Granola Vanilla Cinnamon Cluster. This is from Amazon. Put it up close so you can see, get a better look. Let's just pray that the autofocus is working right now. Um, if it's not, I am terribly sorry. <laughs> I don't have it hooked up to my phone like I normally do. Um, but this is from Amazon. This is a cereal. It says it's a granola that you could use as a cereal. I personally don't really like it as a granola. I only like it as a cereal because it's kind of like fine and kind of strange. It has a slight aftertaste like keto stuff does, but this is pretty much the only thing on my list of things that does have that little bitty aftertaste. My husband really loves to eat this with fruit as well. He'll add some blueberries on top um, with a little bit of almond milk. This is also soy free, gluten free, grain free, everything free, yeah. Pretty good. It's a great little snack if you want like a bowl of cereal or you can eat it dry. I just don't prefer to do that. Up next, I found this delicious granola from Whole Foods. It's the brand Kitsch Fix. Um, I love this this kind. I've had it before. It's cocoa sea salt granola and this one is honey pecan granola. They are so amazing and delicious. I believe they're both vegan. Oh, this one is pure honey. This one ain't vegan. This one's vegan because my vegan friend approved of it. And it is delicious. It's just made with like nuts and seeds and coconut. And this one has the same stuff except honey. And it is so to die for. It's so delicious and addictive. And I like that it's like not hard. I don't like hard stuff, but it also doesn't taste like a nut mix. I do love nut mix which we'll, we'll get onto that in a minute, but I don't know. This is like in its own category. I wish more people knew about it, and if you're a part of the Kitsch Fix marketing team, y'all, share this, because it is delicious, just people just don't know about it. Since we're on the granola kick, we might as well keep going. My husband loves these. This is the Green Free Granola Bites from Lark Ellen Farm in Vanilla Cinnamon. What a name. Um, it's vegan, gluten-free, paleo, low-carb, Super delicious. Um, my husband is addicted to it. I believe we get it from Whole Foods. This one is definitely more in line with your traditional granola as opposed to this kind of stuff, um, which is why it's like not my number one favorite. This is my number one favorite. But if you do love granola, check this guy out at Whole Foods. Delicious. Up next, we have a couple of different nut mixes. I love like a big mix of nuts. And then of course, pistachios. I got these on my flight the other day. These are both very healthy options. Of course, if you want to be even more healthy than I, don't get the one with the chocolate in it because, you know, have a little chocolate addiction. It's fine. Um, but you know, just adding a few pieces is better than eating a whole candy bar. You know what I'm saying? So these are two options, really great, easy to find. I mean, you could literally find nuts anywhere. So that's an easy one. I mentioned this in my Whole Foods grocery haul. These are organic coconut wraps in cinnamon. Oh my gosh, these are so good to make a low carb toaster, toaster strudel with. My husband made it up. It's delicious. You just like, I guess, toast these on the stove. I don't really know. And then you add um, like some nut butter and some coconut whipped cream and it makes for a hell of a healthy sweet snack. Like I said, I got a sweet tooth. They're all sweet really. And this just satisfies it and it's super healthy. Wouldn't recommend all the other flavors, but the co the coconut, the cinnamon one is the good one. Up next is this coconut whipped cream. Oh my god, it's so good. Um, I love this stuff. I've loved it for years. Um, it's called Coco Whip from the brand So Delicious. I do not like their ice cream, but I do love their coconut whipped cream, and I eat it as ice cream. It is so freaking good. Four carbs per serving, three grams of sugar. Sign me up. It is like thick like ice cream. Not exactly like ice cream. It's more like moussey sort of, but not like a mousse at the same. It's like a very unique texture and it's not like too coconutty because I'm not a big coconut fan. So I like how it's a little bit different, but man, this stuff is so addictive. After dinner last night, I had a lot of it as a dessert, but I also eat it as a sweet snack too. Up next is kale chips. So easy to grab and go to. I love kale chips so much. I'm so addicted to them. I get everyone into kale chips. Like, you come to my house, we're gonna have some kale chips. Uh, still haven't tried the mango habanero, but we'll let y'all know. Um, actually, I'll just spray right now. 
I'm kind of nervous because I don't do spicy, so hopefully it's not too spicy. Those are gonna smell like anything. Hmm. Okay, now those are really good, but I don't really take. I was about to say I don't taste the spice, but it's a creeper. It's not too spicy though. I don't do spice, so it's like less than sriracha hot, but it creeps a little bit at the end. But these are both delicious, healthy options. Man, I just love kale chips and always buy this brand. Like, <laughs> the other brands suck. Okay, yep. I guess a little hotter as it lingers in your mouth. Um, but definitely highly recommend these. And from the same brand, last but not least, we have Cauliflower Bites. I love these, and I really regret not buying them in every flavor, because I've never seen all the flavors they had the other day, but they have these in a million flavors too. I personally think they taste like croutons. They have like the same seasoning as a crouton type of vibe. These are organic cauliflower bites. I got them at Whole Foods, and they have, in the entire bag, they have six net carbs. So that's pretty good for the whole bag. So yeah, highly recommend. They also make beet chips and mango bites, it says on the back. I'll have to check them out because this brand, man, does not do me wrong. It is so good. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed today's video. And if you did, please be sure to give it a big thumbs up. And if you want to stick around for more, hit the subscribe button down below. I'll see you all next time. Bye.